No matter what you do, I think the pedal drive is a soul-sucking endeavor. If Bella Bella had a road that I could get a truck to, we would not be here right now. I hate this place. I don't know, I, I didn't mind the pedaling. You know, you kind of get into the rhythm and it's, uh, you know, it's like a walking meditation, except it's pedaling and you just sort of go to that sort of neutral place and you just kind of grind it out. Like, I wanted interviews. I wanted you to say something. No, this is what we got. Pedaling. And I found I could sleep while pedaling. <laughs> That's really kind of a win if you can sleep and pedal. He's not lying. Yeah. So what made you think that getting on a boat without much experience to race to Alaska was a good idea? Well, I didn't know it was going to get that intense that fast. You know, I thought maybe we could ease into it a little bit. Uh, you know, and I'd, I'd been reading, you know, I worked through uh, Chapman's, um, you know, uh, piloting and seamanship over this last winter and a couple other, you know, heavy hardbound tones. And uh, it was great because every now and then a little blimp of that Chapman's book would come out. But we'd be like in some kind of dire situation and Marty's like, is this when you would deploy a sea anchor? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, no, we don't have one of those. We would like to turn out the rogue. Obviously, Stern would be appropriate at this moment. <laughs> Might I suggest Sorry, the nine like, iron, sir? He's like, welcome to Alaska. Yeah. Punch drum. Yeah, cash in. Hey! Where's that bell? <laughs> Somebody said something about a bell. Yeah. Ready? Yeah. Oh, you do. <laughs> Right.